Okay, but uh, Jamie told him, if you refuse, I cannot evict my own citizens from their properties and give it to only one person. You understand? Then, uh, yeah, then I think he left the country, but now he's not even in the country now. It's one of his friends by the name Barry, yes, who's following the mat at the courthouse. Yes. With profound respect, I'm an ex-officer, and I'm a law-abiding citizen, and I will ask my people to be law-abiding citizens too. So if you give us a little bit time, all will be set to light. You know, it's, we're all doing this in the interest of justice. You know, this is our mother land. To have the Gambian civil whatever that are working at the government to just work in, in their fellow Gambians based on some white man's story and then telling us to leave our homes. This is unacceptable. What I am saying is let the government or whoever needs to see this take action because this cannot continue. We can't buy our house, build our house, live in safely and happy and one night, just one morning, someone walks in and tells us to leave. It's not okay. Let the government take step. Let the government involve. We are citizens and we're entitled to our rights. This is unacceptable and we are not going anywhere. They spoke to a lawyer. The lawyer said he has a whatever client. That's fine. But we have nothing more to say. I just want this to be on the media so that the Gambian people know that we have been harassed. We're Gambians, but we are not entitled to anything. We have no rights to anything. Anyone can walk out from the door or come in and just tell us to leave. It's unacceptable. Let the Gambians stand up for what we believe in. We are Gambians. Let us stand up. This is unacceptable. We voted for democracy. I, I don't, like... I'm just going to stop talking, but I want this to be out there. It's over 22 compounds. Over 22. We're going to leave the house for what? We bought this house, we spent our money. When we're Gambians, we're entitled to it. If they want to take the matter to court, let it be legitimate, but you don't walk through our door and tell us to leave. It's unacceptable. President Barrow, if you're hearing this, take action. You should take action. You shouldn't be allowing your citizen to be suffering and going through humiliations like this. It's very unacceptable.